kal halalium lai hawo bahasham yawashai waharakakwadash which is the ancient pale hebrew for all praise to yahawo who the heavenly father's only name who the world ignorantly calls jah jehovah etc in the name of yahawashai his son's only only name who the world ignorantly calls yeshua jesus etc and the Holy Spirit, or Kakwadash, the wisdom and understanding of these holy scriptures, right? Um, and now it's time for us to pray even more. And, uh, and true spirit, and I've been watching a lot of videos with Apostle Tahar and different brothers and so Apostle Arambla Abslakia, Apostle Tahar, Akbar and whatnot, apostles in general, and you know, elders and whatnot. And um, you know. Oh, Apostle Ramla brought out a video, the spirits are active. Um, Kazak brought out his video. Let me just pull it up real quick. Let me show you your name. It says, invest in eternity and brethren, pray for us. All right? So we got to invest our times in, our, you know, checking out our brothers and praying for our brothers, all right? And, you know, you might get different ailments um, spiritually, physically, mentally, and whatnot, but we got to pray. And this is... um. Jeremiah chapter 17 verse 14 says heal me O Yahweh O Lord and I shall be healed save me and I shall be saved for thou art my praise all right so I just switched it up a bit so that um, we can break down according to the Hebrew so just lucky if you know if you might be a little confused or whatnot it says uh the I break down like uh, in this in Hebrew rapa'a Naya Yahawa wa arapa'a Hawashai Naya wa awashai ha Kaya Sahalakia Atha. All right, let me read that again. Rapa'a Naya Yahawa wa arapa'a Hawashai Naya wa awashai. Ha kaya thahalakya atha. All right, and it um it breaks down like this. All right, so you can understand the words rapa'a is heal, naya is me. You can use ya sometimes, but it depends on uh on how how it how the sentence structure and context and whatnot. Yahweh is our Lord and um. Wa'a rapa'a is and I heal. Wa is and I is a rapa'a is heal. Hawashai naya, hawashai save naya is me. Um, wa'a wa'a washai ha. Wa is and a is I. Washai is from Hawashai, yeah, because it's a compound phrase. And ha at the end implies a um, third person, all right? Sometimes it's, it's, a, it's a feminine, um, feminine um, implication, but um, for this it would imply a third person, right? Um, and feminine, because... Uh, Within the same book, it, or, you know, Israel is compared to a common and delicate woman, roughly paraphrasing. So, Kaya is for Thahalakia, Thaha, Thahal, Thahal is praise. Athini, Athini, Tha, the end, you know, would imply a feminine context. All right, but, um, you know, we got to, you know, apply, you got to keep reading in Hebrew, so, so you understand. So just, you know, teaching from what I was taught from, uh, you know, elders and what, elders and apostles. Um, Yad N is my, and Atha is thou are you, all right? So let me read it again. It's Rapa'a Naya, Rapa'a Naya, Yahweh. Wa'a rapa'a hawashai naya wa'a washai ha 
kaya tahalatya ata. Right? And I'm short and straight to the point. You know, keep praying for brothers. Pray for yourself as well. You know, if you want to... Um, um, you know, anointed brother or not, anointed brother, you know, according to James chapter 5 verse 16, you could, and if the brother's not versed in this, you can say it and you repeat it after you and you uh, anoint him and, you know, and, you know, with his pretty albash, you know, shy to do the work. So, with that, I want to say, double honesty, apostles, and elders of greatness, so on a salutation of sincere atheism. Pray this lesson was very fine. Tawari al-Bashim, your chef, when the spirit will make you do this lesson. Inshallah, makiyam, yeah.